Good afternoon folks, welcome back to Boddington Farm. Well, today, <coughs> I have been doing a few bits and odds and sods around the place. Set up a couple of uh, raised garden beds for a bibby that we got from Bunnings, which are pretty good. Then, let's see, what else did I do today? Oh yeah, I uh, completely raked out, marked out the chickens run and re-bedded it with some sugar cane mulch that's my um, personal choice or preference for when it comes to bedding the um, uh, chicken coop but also what I did today you can just make it out there I got we got some um, uh, garden edging stuff from Bunnings and initially when I laid it out it was <laughs> Me, really tall and really high. So what I did is that I cut it in half, which doubled the area it covered. And what we're doing with this is, as you can see, I bedded it. But this is where we're going to be dumping all of the of the uh, scraps for the girls to uh, chew on, to eat on, as well as their breakfast in the morning. So it'll all go in there. And the aim is that it'll end up with a collection of not only you know, food scraps and whatnot, but also the, their um, droppings. And that's going to form like a little compost um, uh, collecting section. After a while, I'll empty that out, take that down to the compost heap, and then top it up and, we, and, we, and you go again. So that's gonna be like a source of chicken compost for us. I thought, okay, I'm going to come down here because I know how you folks love watching the chooks doing their chooky thing. There's one of the little brahmas getting off. There's little Miss Peanut. And here's some corn and wheat for them. So, I'm just going to chuck it around and watch them go. They, they love their corn and wheat. And they, and they love having a good scratch. So there you go, folks. Bit of a garden tip there. If you've got chickens and you want to start yourself off with, with some compost, put up a little, like a little circled off area, dump some mulch in there, and some in the food scraps. And you keep on dumping the food scraps in there and you'll, in the, and you'll end up with some nice compost to add in, into your garden. There you go folks. So if you like what you've seen and it's giving you some inspiration, give us a big thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, share the bejeepers out of this and tickle the bell so you'll be notified when we put up a, a new video. Here we go, Reese.
please folks give us a big thumbs up share this hit the subscribe button and tickle that bell to receive notifications